Hi, I'm Ryan, the Equipment Guy from Performance Food Centers, Division of Simple Again. Today I'm going to review the uh, procedures for receiving your Blendtec blender. First, we're going to remove the blender from the box. Next, remove the foam from the blender. Keep in mind not to discard these foam pieces. These come in handy when having to send your blender back for any kind of warranty or service work. Remove the plastic from the blender and unwrap the power cord. Inspect the power cord to make sure there are no physical breaks or cuts in the cord. Next, make sure that you have all of your parts. You're going to have a Blendtec motor base or stand. Your Blendtec motor is going to be inside. You're going to have a sound enclosure, which is two pieces. And your blender, if purchased from Performance Food Centers, will come with two jars. The second jar will be in the smaller box. Both of those jars are going to come with hard lids and you're going to inspect those jars before using them to make sure that the uh, blade just turns freely and there's nothing there preventing it from turning. This blender looks great. You're going to check over the ventilation grids to make sure that there's nothing blocking them. This will prevent your motor from overheating and you're ready to plug in. You're going to plug your blender into a 20 amp dedicated outlet. Dedicated means there's nothing else on that circuit. Once your blender is plugged in, you can simply turn it on and you're ready to start blending. That's all for today. Have a great day.